My name's Ethan. And my name is Billy. And we work with Wesson. Yeah. Question one, how did the collaboration come about? Well, I mean, you know. Yeah, I guess it was uh, like a year and a half ago, I think it was Lee from P Co reached out to us via email. Or he, he DM'd Fred, our photographer, yeah, yeah, yeah. on Instagram He's first. Been him and Fred have been following each other for a while. And yeah, he DM'd Fred and was like, yo. Let's do a collab. Yeah, exactly. And then uh, we hopped on a FaceTime and it was it was going to happen after that pretty much. Yeah. So We originally thought it would be something quick, you know. We're like, hey, let's do something cool, you know, two, three months on the road, pop it out, you know. But a year later, we're still uh, working on it, you know. <laughs> yeah, it took a while. It was supposed to be for the P&Co 10-year anniversary, yeah, yeah. but then uh, it became something a little bit bigger than yeah. that. But so. with everything great comes time and commitment, and this is going to be one of the greatest things, I think. I, I would say our best collab yet today. Yeah, without a doubt. Yeah, Without a doubt. All right. Is the Knife UK legal? Hot question, straight off the press. Yeah. Easy answer, yes. Yeah, that's UK legal. That's the entire premise behind the knife. p &Co reached out to us. They, uh, we sent them some, some knives. Uh, Ethan sent over some knives and we did a call and they were like, we love these knives, you know, we like this one and this one. And we were like, yeah, there's one like kind of red flag about the specific knife you love, which was our microblade, yeah. is it's technically illegal in the UK. In the UK. Yeah. yeah. Cause it's a locking knife. So we set out on a journey to create something uh, that would work for both of our audiences and markets. and. We did something I actually never thought we would do. Like, but uh, the Pinko guys are persuasive. Yeah, for exactly. sure. Inspirational, yeah. I would use the word. Yeah, in a good way. In a good way. And um, yeah, I redesigned the microblade to be something entirely new, and um, which birthed the uh, Wesson X Pinko. Uh, a soon to be a collaboration knife, which is yeah, we, we still don't have a name. We don't have a name it, yet. Yeah. By the time this comes out, there probably will be a name for it, and it'll be really nice. All right. Question three. <laughs> What is the knife made out of? Um, a lot of things. Yeah, I mean, we can start with love. That's the, yeah, the very that is the number one uh, love, key thing every Western good is made with. Love, creativity, passion, friendship. Um, yeah. There's a lot of things that went behind the making of this knife. But the main material... I mean, there's a slogan that kind of has inspired the entirety of this Absolutely. Knife. Yeah. And I think we had that before we had the material secured, yeah, actually. Yeah. So we kind of locked to it. Um, and that's brass. We use brass on the handle completely for this knife. Which yeah. is really unique. It gives it a really like old school, like beautiful feeling and look to it. I would yeah. say um, it's our most. I would say it's our most heritage approach easily to a knife. Yeah. Um, the design of this knife is is uh, you know it's a slip joint, so it's a very it's a very old take on you know a traditional pocket knife. Yeah. Like it's, it it follows a lot of like you know what you would know as being a pocket knife. You know, it's a slip joint, non locking, very easy to handle knife, and yeah. we went with. A material that follows suit it's brass you know yeah. this will age with you it'll be insane it'll have a patina yeah. um, it'll be beautiful um, you know brass is a, a very very common you know material used throughout history and you know in yeah. things that have been passed down from time to time so we wanted to do something uh, working alongside with P and Co also like a brand that takes pride in the products yeah something that lasts we wanted to do something that represented you know our relationship and so yeah. something bold as brass right yeah. I think that it like represents both Pinko's heritage and Wesson's heritage too. Wesson being from Detroit, which has this industrial roots, and Pinko being from Birmingham, which also has this kind of yeah, industrial roots exactly. to it. Um, it was and the being, perfect product. You know, Pinko's headquarters is right in the, the jewelry the quarter. quarter yep, yeah, which is also you know brass is significant uh, you know yeah. material used within that region as well. So I think yeah. this there's no other reason why we would would not use brass. And yeah. if you know Wesson well, we've been very true to titanium throughout the years. Yeah. Um, but now I think we're able to switch it it's up. It's time to change yeah. it up. Use For, with a reason. Yeah. 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 And I think it's probably going to be the best aging knife that we've ever met. Yeah. Or made. And met. We and will, met. We will. This one's a doozy. Is this a one-off collaboration or will there be more to come? Well, well I hope that there's <laughs> more to come. <laughs> I will say that right now. Um, well, this, this collaboration, maybe this version of it, is the only one you're going to see. So you're going to want to get this because this is 100% limited edition, 100% yeah, exactly. limited collab. We, we made a specific number for this drop. But um, I would say the sky's the limit. You know, you yeah, never absolutely. know what P and Co and Weston are going to get up to. Um, no, we definitely, I will say they're friends. Yeah. Um, you know, we consider them close friends and we would take any opportunity to work together again. Um, we love to explore other mediums. Like, yeah. you know, Weston specializes in pocket knife and everyday carry goods. And that's like, that's what we're known for. And P&Co is known for their clothing and garments. 
And if we could partner together to do, you know, more for each other, like, you know, Wessing venture more into the garment world and P and Co venture more into the, you know, accessory world, then like we'd love to do more together. 100%. I think that there's a an amazing crossover between them and us, both as people and and as brands. Yeah. So I'm one hundred percent for a long a long working relationship. And hopefully this is the first of many. Yeah. I couldn't have said it better than myself. <laughs> Question written down is will they be limited edition? Yeah, yes. they're going to yeah, be limited. I feel be. like we covered that in the last exactly. one. Yeah, um, every knife is, I mean, we we always take pride in these collaborations because we we want them to have value. Like we, we want the, the owners to feel significant, you know, a uniqueness to each one they own. So we love yeah. to do limited runs on these things. Um, you know, of course, like with demand, you know, we might do a spin off and we might do a secondary drop and stuff like that. But this drop together will be a limited drop. Yeah. Um, it's going to come with some, you know, a few surprises inside the box. Yeah. And it's going to be something that, you know, you know, you get one now, like, you know, you won't be able to get that again. But, yeah. Um, ultimately, you know, we want to make sure that we're able to deliver this knife to as many people as possible. But at the same time, you know, you got to keep it limited. We got to keep, keep it limited. That's my favorite thing about collabs yeah. when we do exactly. them is that. They become collector's items, you know, and the more time that passes, you realize, wait, I got my hands on something valuable here, something that not everyone just has. Yeah, exactly. Um, and I think that's a really important part to a good collab, yeah. and it's worth it. So buy it, because you'll be able to sell it on eBay for more than you bought it. So Millions of pounds. Millions. Of Millions pounds. of pounds, yeah. guaranteed. Like, Will the collaboration just be the knife, or will there be more products in the range? Well, like Billy said, there's yeah. some surprises in the box, and there actually is an entire range that P&Co has designed, which I think is amazing. I'm wearing one right now. Yep. Maybe I shouldn't have been wearing it. No, wearing it's good. It. It's promotion. I think so. Um, P&Co's crushed it with this. They made uh, a hat, a really beautiful t-shirt, and then kind of like a, a pullover yeah. as well that, sure, yeah. that really um, showed the best parts of the collab off. And we did something that we never thought we would do, and that was put the microblade on a pullover. Yeah. Now, this yep. has been something that Billy's been talking about for years, how we would never do it. But it's finally happened, and, and I'm super excited yeah. about it. Yeah. I mean, I've always wanted to do a, like do garments, but like as I said, we specialize in pocket knives and accessories, like hard goods. Yeah. Um, so I knew if we were going to venture into that world, like making a hat or a t-shirt or a sweatshirt in this case, it needed to be with the best. So yeah. we got extremely blessed for P and Co to jump on board and actually design and, and create. Crazy. Some of the yeah, some of the best garments I could ever ask for coming through. Yeah, and yes, lo and behold, they do they do feature um, this collaboration knife, and yeah. I think it turned out really well. Absolutely. So um, I mean, these are super limited too. These are more the more limited are more than the knives. Than the knives actually, yeah. so, so if if you're interested in rocking those like day one, because I'm gonna sell half to my friends. And yeah, family. they're gonna be. I mean, uh, I would say half's going to the team. They're all buying one. Yeah, so all, I'm gonna, gonna wear it every day. Yeah, it's yeah. a new team uniform. Last one. When will the collaboration drop? I have to check my calendar. Yes, check your calendar. Right there. I have no that, idea. It's that day. So we have um, an event date. Ethan has no events on his calendar. Yeah, but I know, I know what date. date it is. I know where it is. Um, when will the collaboration drop? At the end of this month, January, the 26th of January is the day this thing's finally coming out. Yes. Um, quite literally years in the making, so we're super excited as the days count down. It's going to be crazy. Yep. Yeah. Actually, it's one of the best collabs we've done today. We're super excited. Yeah. Couldn't be more happy to be partnering up with a brand that we've idolized for years. Yeah. And the uh, best of the best. Yep. Um, and I think you're going to feel that in the collab, like how much time has gone into it, the friendship we've developed between brands, and uh, the care that we've taken to really make this something special. Absolutely. Yeah. So thank you. Peace.